is doing something very, very special today. It's a very momentous occasion for dad because it's the first time in his long, long, long life <laughs> that he's been allowed to vote in a United States election. He will be voting for the first time for the president of the United States. So today, dad's a real American. Yes. So in the state of Washington, everyone does all of their voting by mail. It's been that way for years and years and years. And I know that that's a, kind of a contentious point this year for the election, but Washington has done voting by mail for a long, long time. This has not changed for this year. So all of our ballots come in the mail just like this. And dad got his in the mail and he's super excited to fill it out and send it in. So the thing is, it's really not important who you vote for. It's not important what your political stance is, as long as you respect everyone for all of their beliefs, everything's fine. We don't have any political agenda to, to voice here. All I'm saying is it's a very important thing to vote. If you have a strong opinion one way or the other, make sure you get your opinion out there so that you have a say in the election. It's important. Yep. Uh, so, Dad, time to take on your civic duty. Yep. You ready so, for this? Yep. I just, I'm really super excited. So I just opened the envelope. It came with a... This is mommy's right here, but I opened the envelope and it has the uh, official drop box and then when you're done, you peel your little thingy and... And then you can say you voted by mail and you can wear your sticker around. Probably. So Are you going to like have yours laminated so you can like frame it? I sure, sure. <laughs> we have to go to the Y to drop Okay, we'll off. go to the Y and drop it off. Okay. Um, so there's that. Let me see what else is in Yeah, what else do we get in our mail-in so ballot? This is the, the official... Bless you. This is the official envelope when you put your, your uh, um, ballot, ballot. in, you have to sign it. So they know it's official? Correct. And uh, oh, I guess you have to put it in your secret sleeve before you put it in there. Ooh, that's why so nobody can so see nobody it. Nobody can see it. Nice. And judge you for what you <laughs> And here is the official ballot. So right here, if you guys can see this thing right here. You're supposed to tear it when you're done, and then you go to the in our county website, and then you can see if they counted it. Your thing, yeah, your your ballot and count. So there's two things. There's a lot to pick from, but a lot of options. It tells you right here that you're supposed to circle the darken the space. Darken right? the space. You don't circle it. You darken, you darken the space. It. Yep. And if you make a mistake, you can just put a line all the way through your choice, and, and then mark the one that you like. Mm -hmm. Yep. So there's a lot of things to add, but well, there's a lot of uh, things that you're voting for. So in our county, there's a, or in our state actually, there's a couple of um, advisory votes, or referendum measurements that you have to take. Yep, that's pretty normal. So on, so there's two sides. So, I'm very excited, let's get started. Got my pen ready to go. Do you know who you want to vote for? I do. Are you willing to disclose that on YouTube? I love everybody, but no, that's a secret <laughs> thing. <laughs> All right. last one right all right I'm done I'm done okay now you're not done actually because you have to take that put it in your secrecy sleeve put it in the envelope and deliver it to the ballot box or obviously it won't count but once we get all that done guys we have something much more exciting for the kids because they don't understand why voting is exciting although dad is excited um we're gonna go stay at the mermaid Inn tonight we have got some planning to do because Halloween is coming up. That's right. So we've got to go plan what we're gonna do for Halloween and spend some time with the cousins, playing video games, hanging out, having some fun. And uh, I, I don't know if you can tell, but we have some kids that are excited about <laughs> staying at the Mermaid Sounds Inn. Like excited. Yeah. <laughs> I'm excited about this. Yeah, yeah. We'll Look, go, we'll go drop that off on the way. I'm gonna put it in my secret sleeve. Secrecy sleeve. It doesn't fit. It's okay, it's in the sleeve. Nobody can read it. So because of the moisture in the air where we live, our envelope, Daddy's envelope, not our envelope, Daddy's envelope got sealed because of the moisture in the air. So he's got to peel it open so he can even get his ballot in there. Gosh. That's it. Throw it in the garbage. Yeah, it's actually, it's bad. It has no glue. 
I guess we can throw some tape on there. I don't know. Well, we can put some uh, glue and then sign it. Okay. Nothing to seal. <laughs> Whoop. The official signature on the official ballot saying that dad is an official human. What's the date today? Today is the day of October. 10. 24? Done. Ta-da! Back in September, Dad became an official United States citizen, and his first official thing to do after becoming a citizen was to register to vote. And this is the culmination of that very amazing moment. So, Dad, I'm actually, I'm actually super proud. To me, this is a very important day. So, here it goes. Ta-da! Now I can proudly. Wait, let me see what you got. Oh, voted by mail. Yep, you gotta wear your sticker. Put your sticker on, Dad. You should walk around and show people your sticker. There you go. On it goes. Dad voted. Woohoo, Dad! So now that that's done, it's official. We can head to the Mermaid Inn and spend some time with the cousins and Aunt Jesse. And it's cold out here, so let's hurry up. And so. Video, 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 video